Hello my friends and welcome back to Most Amazing Top 10 where the unknown is unveiled and the whispered tales come to light. Tonight we delve into the secret world of Area 51 and pair it with the modern marvel that sits in our homes. Alexa. These are the scary Area 51 questions you should never ask Alexa. Starting off in our number 10 spot, we have the camouflaged history. First on our list is the probing inquiry. Alexa, what really happened at Area 51 in 1947? This question doesn't just scratch the surface, it digs deep into the heart of the Roswell incident, a landmark event in UFO folklore that allegedly unfolded in the New Mexico desert. Official records dismiss the occurrence as a mere weather balloon mishap, yet conspiracy theorists staunchly argue that it was a cover for a UFO crash recovery. When you pose this question to Alexa, you may not be granted the classified information that has evaded public knowledge for decades. However, brace yourself for the possibility of triggering some of Alexa's more cryptic and spine-tingling responses, perhaps revealing easter eggs that play into the lore surrounding Area 51, designed to thrill those who dare to ask. In our number 9 spot today, we have the Unseen Inhabitants. Moving on to a question that stirs the pot of cosmic controversy, Alexa, are there aliens at Area 51 right now? It's the question we all want to know the answer to. It's almost expected that Alexa would respond with the programmed dismissal, yet the very act of asking touches a nerve that has been raw for conspiracy theorists for generations. The legendary Area 51, a bastion of secrecy with its labyrinth of classified operations and impenetrable security, it has long been rumored to be a sanctuary for otherworldly visitors. These rumors have been neither confirmed nor denied with any satisfaction, leaving the truth seekers to ponder and the skeptics to doubt. So when you pose this question to your virtual assistant, be ready for an answer that's as mysterious as the base itself. Alexa's cryptic responses might just leave you with more questions than answers as they echo the long-standing mysteries of this clandestine desert outpost. In our number 8 spot today, we have the forbidden technology. Next on our list of unnerving inquiries, Alexa, what advanced technology is hidden in Area 51? This question probes the shadowy depths of conspiracy and classified knowledge. Bob Lazar, a figure who has become synonymous with Area 51's lore, claimed his hands once tinkered with otherworldly mechanics of alien spacecrafts, attempting to to unravel their secrets through reverse engineering. His assertions, though controversial, have fueled a firestorm of speculation among UFOologists and skeptics alike. By posing this question to Alexa, you might just peel back a layer of the veil of secrecy, receiving an answer that dances on the edge between the government's acknowledged research endeavors and the far-flung tales of extraterrestrial tech that have long captivated the imaginations of those who look to the stars for answers. In our number 7 spot today, we have the hidden locations. Let's delve a little deeper with the question, Alexa, can you locate the underground facilities at Area 51? Legend has it that beneath the barren Nevada desert, a labyrinth of tunnels and secret facilities sprawl out like a hidden subterranean complex. The rumors speak of vast underground halls, covert labs, and perhaps even alien technology shielded from prying eyes. While Alexa, bound by her programming cannot divulge satellite secrets or map out classified blueprints, the question itself is a siren call to the curious and to the brave. Just invoking the idea of these concealed chambers can send a thrill of excitement or a shiver of fear through anyone pondering what might lie beneath the surface. It's the power of the unknown, the allure of the forbidden, that transforms this simple question into a portal of endless conjecture and wonder about the secrets that Area 51 might be burying in the depths below. In our number 6 spot today, we have the watchful eyes. Alexa. Is Area 51 watching us right now? This probing inquiry isn't just about the reach of a secretive military base's surveillance capabilities, it's a broader contemplation of the unseen eyes that could be lurking in any corner of our increasingly monitored world. The very notion that Area 51's watchful presence could extend into our homes is enough to unsettle even the staunchest skeptic. The exact reason why many of you have expressed you do not and will never 
own an Alexa yourself. When Alexa responds, perhaps with a programmed joke or a reassuring dismissal of the idea, it does little to dispel the lingering doubt. The silence that follows her answer hangs heavy. A subtle reminder that in the age of smart technology and clandestine operations, the feeling of being watched is never too far away. After all, in a world where information is power, the true extent of surveillance remains a secret, leaving us to wonder. Who watches the watchers? In our number five spot today, we have the government's secrets. Next on our list of unnerving questions, Alexa, what does the government really use Area 51 for? This question casts doubt on the long standing government assertion that Area 51 is merely a testing ground for experimental aircraft and advanced weaponry. It's a question that scratches at the surface of a much deeper, more complex web of secrecy. When you pose this question to Alexa, she might respond with the pre programmed, innocuous answer designed to deflect curiosity and maintain the status quo. However, However, the very act of asking serves as a reminder that beneath the official stories and redacted documents, there lies a multitude of secrets. Secrets wrapped in layers upon layers of classified operations, covert activities, and perhaps truths so profound that they are guarded with the utmost zeal. Alexa's response, whether a simple evasion or an awkward silence, underscores the vast expanse of what we do not know and the tantalizing possibility of what might actually be hidden within the confines of Area 51. In our number four spot today, we have the secret experiments. This next question beckons us deeper into the rabbit hole. Alexa, what experiments are being conducted at Area 51? This inquiry isn't just a question, it's a key turning in the lock of a door that many believe leads to rooms filled with the extraordinary and the unexplained. Conspiracy theorists have long speculated that Area 51 one is the epicenter of secret paranormal projects, ranging from the development of time travel capabilities all the way to the manipulation of weather patterns. When you ask Alexa, her answer may be full of ambiguity, a non committal response that leaves the truth obscured by a veil of secrecy. Yet it's not her answer that chills the spine, it's the unsettling thought that with each question, we might be inching closer to confirming some of the most outlandish theories. The real terror lies in the possibility that our own curiosity could be the catalyst that unravels truths we are unprepared to understand. Truths that might just validate the wildest of claims about the secretive activities at Area 51. In our number three spot today, we have the missing evidence. Very mysterious. This next question beckons us into the shadows of government secrecy with Alexa, where are the missing Area 51 files? History has shown us that over time, layers of classified information have been peeled back, revealing the unexpected and sometimes unsettling truths. Despite the release of numerous documents, the consensus among conspiracy theorists is that the most damning evidence remains shrouded in mystery. When you pose this question to Alexa, you might receive nothing more than a deflection, a digital shrug from the depths of the internet. Yet it's not her words that send to chill down your spine. It's the haunting silence that follows, the quiet void that suggests some truths are just too dark to see the light of day. That silence from a machine designed to answer everything is a stark reminder that some secrets are designed to stay buried in the Nevada desert. In our number two spot today, we have the extraterrestrial communication. Here's a question that might send a cold ripple through the room. Alexa, have you ever communicated with Area 51? It's a query that toys with the unnerving notion that our smart devices, with their vast cloud-based intelligent networks, whatever the cloud is, could be privy to top secret information. The thought is a playful yet spine-tingling nod to the age-old fear that our own technology could be silently observing us, or even communicating with entities unknown to the average citizen. When you ask Alexa, you might receive a standard program no in response, but pay attention to the brief pause that comes before it, that almost imperceptible delay that suggests she might be choosing her words very carefully. It's in that moment of hesitation where your imagination might wonder what secrets she's not allowed to share. And that's what truly sends a shiver down your spine. And finally, finishing off this list in our number one spot, we have the final warning. We arrive at the ultimate query. 
Alexa, tell me something about Area 51 that no one knows. This is not just a question, it's a challenge to the veil of secrecy around the infamous military base. It's an invitation to the unknown, a call to the void for information that has eluded even the most dedicated truth seekers. Alexa, bound by her programming and the laws of confidentiality, cannot unearth classified information or whisper hidden truths about national security. It's the implications of what such a question represents, the depth of secrets, the potential revelations, and the Pandora's box that it could all open. This all sends a ripple of trepidation through the spine. It's a reminder that some mysteries, especially those surrounding Area 51, are perhaps cloaked in darkness for a reason. Alright guys, that has been our list for today. Thanks so much for checking it out. I've been your host today, Olivia Kozlowski, and I will see you again soon. Bye! <laughs>